Hi everyone, I'm Jay, and today I'm going to talk to you about eating bugs. Uh, more specifically, bug protein and its ecological contributions and its controversies. So ecologically speaking, insects are phenomenal for, you know, preserving the environment and sustainability. Crickets only require one and a half liters of water to make an entire kilogram of bug protein, whereas making a kilogram of protein for beef takes 3,400 liters of water. Also, crickets are really small, and so you can pack a lot of them into a really small space and produce them in mass quantities in a way that you could not do with any cattle, pork, poultry. Like, it, the ratios are incredible. Also on the case for eating bugs, Thailand has these seasoned deep-fried insects that they just serve as street food. Um, and they're really popular and you know you just grab them it's a very normal thing not only in these other parts of the world but also in you know northwestern hemisphere people are eating bugs just in a different context uh, a lot of the times it's seen as challenged food and on tv there's a show called fear factor which if you haven't seen it um it's just a bunch of people conquering fears and they do it for a cash fr cash prize so uh, I'm going to show a clip. It's pretty gross, so skip ahead if you don't want to see it. But, you know, they are just eating, like, bugs and worms and stuff, and it's a challenge. And even though they're seeing it as challenge food and it's gross, there is, that is evidence that people are changing and that, you know, eating bugs is more, getting more normalized. And now for the other side of the argument. Not everybody's gonna eat a bug. Not a majority of people are gonna eat a bug. Nobody's gonna like choose to eat a cricket burger over like a Big Mac. Well, some people might, but not a majority. And that is where I see this argument not going super well. Even though you have a few open minds, I do not think that it is going to happen in the quantity that it will serve all of these environmental needs the way it promises. My final thoughts are I love the idea of insect-based protein and how eco ecologically friendly that it could be. I just don't see it happening, especially with the Western culture that we live in, that it's going to happen in, in, a, in enough of a quantity for it to be sustainable. I think there are better alternatives to saving the environment than having people, than having a majority of people switch over their already comfortable diets. And those are my final thoughts.